Hey folks, welcome back here to the Vegas Don Channel. We're here at uh, Red Rock National Conservation Area, Key Keystone Thrust White Rock Mountain. It says there, uh, that says Grand Circle right there. And I'll zoom in on this so you can uh, pause it, take a look at it. At your leisure. And then parking area times and closing right there. No camping though. White Rock Mountain, they're right behind us. It's kind of hard to see the whiteness because of the sun, the way the sun, the angle of the sun is right now. But I wanted to show that to you. We'll go ahead and head back out the main road here, or to the main road. This is Red Rock Scenic Loop Drive, it's called. And this is going to take us right up against the uh, foothills of the Spring Mountains here, it looks like. Ooh, uh, that sun. Radar enforced. Kind of see the city down there a little bit. Las Vegas. See that uh, the foothills right here at the base of this mountain. I always thought that they did that the uh, federal government wanted all the land out here in Nevada because it's the most mountainous state in the nation mile marker six now here on Red Rock Loop Scenic Drive and uh, if they found gold or silver or anything else in one of these mountains they wanted to be able to use it the government that is they wanted it to be theirs no one else's could claim it this is a one-way road so no worries with any oncoming traffic here. See a little, I want to call it meadow out there, but there's just a little flat area. There's no green grass out there. I'm going to try and keep the sun out of the uh, frame right here this little ridge here you can see that could probably blasted out this section in order to pave the road through it that's typically what they did back in the day when making uh, railroads and roadways, things like that. They would uh, blast through it like that, you see, on both sides of the roadway. Air quality is not the greatest right now. It was uh, just inside the moderate range when we did our Las Vegas Strip View live looking at noon. As the sun is finally hidden behind the mountains there, mile marker seven on this 13 mile scenic loop. You can see there's a horse crossing there, as well as a pedestrian crossing. There's a, uh, you see the sign there, the road sign, there's a U with a little hook that goes off near the, near its apex. So I'm going to 
gonna see if I can, it's the GPS says Oak Canyon something. And that's it there, and it is open. So we'll go ahead and take a look out here. Two-way traffic ahead, okay? Good to know. Parking designated areas only. Speed limit 15. Radar enforced. Check out this rock face here. That's pretty cool. In my humble opinion. Lost Creek Canyon. The sign says there. We'll come back to this. But that is really cool. Bus turn around ahead up here. Love the mountains. I know they're not for everyone, but I'm definitely a fan. Unfortunately, the best of both worlds, at least for me, would be the uh, mountains and the sea, the ocean. And uh, California is just a little too expensive for me, so. Willow Springs, the sign says here. This brings us out here to Willow Springs. Looks like the beginning of another trailhead here. I guess this is the bus turnaround here. North Park Ridge Mountain, it says there. Let me get, see if I can get, oh, 7-Eleven man's gonna love this. Check this out, buddy. Petroglyph Wall. Go ahead and exit the car here. these rocks. That's cool stuff. Petroglyph wall, it says there. I'll try and get close here so you can read it. Elevation 4,500. The highest is 4,600. Tenth of a mile. And the Petrocliff Wall Trail. It's a little warm right now, so I'm not going to try and venture out that way, but uh, cool stuff. Petroglyph Wall would be out that way. And let's take a look over here. We've got some folks out here doing some rock climbing. North Peak. Bridge Mountain, not Ridge, Bridge Mountain. Get up close here so you can see that. Pause it at any point so that you can see it. We got some folks here that are doing some rock climbing up there. Let's go over and grab this sign here. White Rock Mountain Loop Trail. Very cool stuff. Petroglyph Trail. That is a cool looking mountain right there, if I do say so myself. Shaped by wind, rain, the elements over time to become the rock face that you see here in front of you.
not a maintained road, okay. Let's see if we can see these petroglyphs. It's only a tenth of a mile, the sign said, so it shouldn't be too terribly bad. Temperature outside, car reads 95 degrees right now. Certainly not the kind of thing we can go speeding along. to be made for having four-wheel drive, that's for sure. Especially when you like mountains. Oh, those rocks, those rocks there are pretty rough in front of us. Okay, we're not going to try and do that. Those will probably, I'll probably bat, bottom out on those. So, apologies for that. But, uh, there is Petroglyph Rock out there. We'll go ahead and back it up. Turn around. They don't maintain this <laughs> for sure. Go ahead and just try and come out the way we came. survey any damage that we may have done here. Give me just a moment. seeing any. So we'll go ahead get ourselves out of this. Good piece of advice is never to stop on these gravelly rocky roads. When you do you end up in a groove and when you have rear wheel drive like I do, watch out. I thought that the roadway was like this kind of smoother, but it gets really rough up there. These guys are climbing down the rock face there. take a moment and say thank you all so very very much for joining we really appreciate each and every single one of you please do like follow and subscribe to us on youtube and us to other viewers on youtube and tiktok and also helps the algorithm your voice carries so much more weight with the algorithm when you like follow share and subscribe so please do so um also check out our gear available on the shop section of our youtube channel vegas don logo on top of the las vegas strip skyline we've got the upcoming holiday season coming so maybe something for yourself or your significant other and as always remember here on the vegas don channel it's the journey we'll see you next time folks